It's time for another Dice Tower review from Gamer's Remorse. Hello and welcome back to Gamer's Remorse. Today we're going to take a look at a brand new micro game at, from the great game crafter called Bad Dragon Pizza Party, put out by KGB Games. KGB Games stands for Killer Game Bandits. So it's Killer Game Bandits Games. I really think right. this game's gonna be amazing. I have high hopes. Dragons <laughs> and pizza? Yeah, buddy. <laughs> Bad Dragon Pizza Party is a trick-taking microgame for two to four players and takes about ten minutes to play. The objective of the game is to not quit. No, seriously. This is the worst game I've ever played. In fact, I strongly advise you to watch a different video on the Dice Tower. This one is complete and total rubbish. Alright, well, I warned you. In this game, each player is given a deck of cards. The first player plays a card and all players follow suit. Each card has a suit, red, blue, or green, and a value, one through four. The higher the value, the stronger the card. A four beats a three, and a three beats a two, and so on. If a player does not have the suit played, then they are out of luck and need to play an off suit with no chance of winning the hand. In addition, there is a dragon party card that always wins. After a hand, all cards are discarded to a pile called the Deadpool. The player that won the hand reads the red party card out loud to determine how many new dragons they can add back to their hand, either 0, 1, or 2. As subsequent turns are played, players begin to run out of dragons in their hands. The player with the dragons left in their hand at the end of the game wins. Alright dudes, let's party on, dragon style. So there are two decks of cards. The red deck is the pizza deck, and the blue deck is the dragon deck. So we end up with one card left over and we put it in the dead pool, is what they call it. So we each have a deck of cards in our hand. I wish they would have called it like the dragon graveyard. Or the dragon graveyard. The dragon tomb. <laughs> what would you have called the dead pool? And we flip over one pizza. Oh man, bummer! Better luck next time! You get nothing! Oh, snap! To the left of the dealer uh, begins. Yep. So. I'm gonna play a blue two. A blue four? A blue one. I win, Ooh. but I get no, and nothing. And wins nothing! <laughs> Crap. Best party right. ever! So we flip over the next one. Oh man, but <laughs> Are there any other cards in here? We'll find Apparently out. Apparently not. So there's supposed to be pizzas that show up <laughs> which give you more dragons. Yeah. However, so far nothing. Yep. Yeah. So far nothing. Yep. Yeah. Two of green. Two of green. One of green. Oh, that's green. unfortunate. Five. <laughs> I win nothing! So, so far this game needs a little bit of work. Yeah, a little bit. Ooh, here we go. Totally awesome party! Plus Cowabunga, one. dude! Yes. Ooh. Three green. No! Two red. One red. What? Was that the only green left? I guess so. So, since I won the pizza, it says plus one from the Deadpool. I shuffled it up. I'm drawing this one randomly, and it is the worst card in the deck. And then we flip over this one, which of course is two. Whoa, that's cool. Totally awesome. It's spelled with a K. <laughs> so you know it's hit. <laughs> it's hit. Plus two All from right. the Deadpool. So this is a Boom. good one. We Boom want five. it. Red four. Dragon party. I thought I won. <laughs> I was wrong. Dragon party is the best card in the deck. So I so get to draw two, two, two from the Deadpool. After shuffling, we don't want you getting that dragon party Does back. Does someone else want to shuffle? Yes, I do. <laughs> okay. I do not trust him to shuffle that. Never trust a man with a pizza on his head. It's a me, a pizza guy. Dun 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 dun. dun. <laughs> and one of us has to win. Or this in is order the last to stay in. Oh, I could possibly get one back as long as he doesn't have that stinking dragon party. Five of red. Oh crap. <laughs> <laughs> That's that's game. Game. Yeah, that's game. <laughs> Throw the pot. <laughs> let's try and get the pizza. Though. <laughs> All right, so let's go right into review. What did you guys think? Let's start with Brian, and we'll go this way. It's a game that I wish I could have enjoyed. 
The theme is amusing, to be honest. Dragons and pizza. Like, seriously, that sounds amusing. Uh, but the game does not deliver. Um, yeah, it was disappointing. Uh, I mean, it's it's luck of the draw. Whatever you're dealt, you will win. Whoever gets the extra cards, they have the advantage. The one ultimate trump, that's a clear advantage. Um, hmm. But, I mean, at times, like, to be honest, I was laughing. Um... So it, it gets that. Okay, so taking it to my rubric, uh, as far as visuals on a scale of zero to two, I'm gonna give this a 0.5 because I'd feel terrible giving it a zero. Um, but I mean, the, the graphics are nothing special, but I mean, it is kind of silly, like dragons wearing party hats. So <laughs> it gets a point for silliness. Uh, skill luck, I'm gonna give that a zero. It's pretty much entirely luck based pacing you know what shockingly i would give it a two there is no room <laughs> for analysis paralysis in this game no wow. there's not. theme and immersion the theme being dragons having a pizza party <laughs> i'm gonna give it something. you know what i'm gonna give it a 0. 0.5 out of two because i'm that nice uh, mechanics i'm gonna give it a zero um it just copied Trump mechanics, but it copied it very poorly. And was it fun? Zero out of two. I'm going to give that a point five. Um, so, I, yeah. Score on the bottom of the screen. All right. Uh, so, so the backs actually don't look that bad. He used some crazy fonts that I'm not really a fan of in this weird swirly effect. Uh, the pictures, they look like they were stolen, and then <laughs> they put party hats on it. So... <laughs> Probably not good. They went crazy with drop shadow or Gaussian blur or something that I, I don't know. Uh, easily legible. You can yeah. tell the numbers pretty easily, so that's cool. Uh, stolen clip art, clearly. Uh, and weird spelling of things. It looked like they took Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles slang and just ran with it. I could have gone for more Turtles instead of dragons. So right. like, essentially, they just put dragons in place of Ninja Turtles. Yeah. Other things that bothered me was uh, the randomness of whether you win... Maybe it would have been more fun to make it more random and not show the pizza until after you True. played the hand. Mm -hmm. That could have been amazing. But I guess maybe he was trying to inject strategy into it, but it's so silly already. Yeah. Just run with it. I, I don't know. So I'm going to go through my rubric real quick. All right. Quality of components, zero to two. I'm going to give it a, a 0.5. I wasn't really a fan. I will say that there's nice outlines around the card, and I like the numbers. <laughs> I'll give you a 0.5 for that. Skill to luck, no. Zero. Absolutely zero. It was completely luck based. If you got this dragon party card, you win. Yeah, you win. This is just the That's instant good. win card. <laughs> I, uh, anyway, so <laughs> point five thus far. Uh, analysis paralysis. Okay. All right, guy. You get one point for that. <laughs> so you're up to one point five. Theme zero to two. I'm gonna give you zero because it was silly. Like. I, maybe you could buy this as a joke for someone, but beyond that, I, I don't know. White elephant. Mm. Yeah. Thrill competitive, no, zero. So you have 1.5 so far, and was it fun? Um, it's actually on a scale of 1 to 2, so I have to give you one point there. Uh, so I'm going to give you one there, so you're up to 2.5. However, new channel, new rules. We're on the dice tower now, <laughs> so I'm instituting a demerit system. <laughs> you earn two demerits. <laughs> So negative two points because I did not like this game. Wow. Right. First of all, it's silly, which no. I like silly. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> so minus one for that, minus another point because you stole artwork and it it's bad. I, You're at point five. I gave you point five for this game. Worst game ever. <laughs> Thank you. New goal in life. Find a worse game and right. make Sean play it. <laughs> I'm going to enjoy that. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Aaron, what do you think? I stick by my two points, one for dragons, one for pizza. <laughs> <laughs> it's the simplest rubric, but it works. Yeah. So, in fact, to make this game better, part of the rule should be order pizza. Have pizza while playing this game. Yeah. That would get you another two points? Yeah. I would give it more points if I was eating pizza. I suppose Invite dragons over. <laughs> <laughs> and Daenerys Targaryen. Yeah. He went there. 
pizza hat guy trying to be sexy. It's cool. <laughs> <laughs> Another thing I want to bring up is your rules are poor. We had to fill in bits and pieces, which I'm not a fan of. But I think we added more rules, and there are rules on that card. Right. So as to make it actually playable. Mm-hmm. So... However, on the upside, if you go by fun per time invested in creating the game, now your, <laughs> now your average game it takes many man hours, long effort, tedious nights to make a good game, less than three hours. It says so in the rule book. Right. Let Sorry, me, the rule card. Let, yeah, the rule card. <laughs> let, allow me to read the rule card. <clears throat> Bad Dragon Pizza Party is the culmination of almost three hours of work. But it's totally awesome. What is better than pizza and dragons? Answer: Nothing. That part's wow. true. <laughs> that part is true. Yes. <laughs> nothing is better than pizza and dragons. I'm surprised the person that made this game knew the word culmination. <laughs> <laughs> Thesaurus. Thesaurus. Yeah. He googled that. Anyway, <laughs> so that's it from uh, Gamer's Remorse for this week's episode. What do you guys think? Uh, would you consider buying this game uh, as a joke? Comments below. Thanks, guys. I just like how Brian and I are having a bunch of us just like pounding it into the ground. It's just like, no, bad game. Thanks so much for watching the Dice Tower videos. Find more great videos and reviews as well as our top-rated audio podcast at Dicetower.com. You can also find other great shows at Dicetowernetwork.com. I'm Eric Summerer, and you've been watching The Dice Tower. The Dice Tower is sponsored by Cool Stuff, Inc., where you can find great games for great prices. Cool Stuff in stock. Check them out at CoolStuffInc.com. <laughs>